you uh, said uh, sir very uh, eloquently that uh, all the expressions are uh, coming from the atma and nothing is uh, uh, beyond the atma nothing is uh, behind the atma uh, from my uh, practical view point i have a question how to get out of this uh, situation where sometimes the expressions of others i seem to sometimes get reminded of the atma and some expressions i seem to forget the atma especially when there is a provocation or uh, there is uh, some disturbance in the outside i seem to uh, forget uh, the atma at that moment uh, i am uh, uh, would like to request to know how to um, remember the atma in uh, pleasant circumstances and uh, not pleasant circumstances in uh, Uh, in disturbances because uh, from my limit from my experience sometimes the disturbances seem to take me away from the atma some disturbance will happen then i will trigger one reaction then that reaction will trigger one more uh, uh, disturbance then that disturbance will uh, trigger one more reaction in this endless uh, cycle of uh, external disturbance my reaction and this cycle somewhere the atma seems to uh, i want to revive that uh, connection sir how to revive the connection to the atma and break this cycle of disturbance reaction disturbance reaction and keep remembering the atma in the expressions and enriching in the atma sir i request you for illumination first of all the problem is not with the atma but the problem is in the expression in the expression some expression may be good some expression may be a uh, sweet some expression may be painful so the problem is only within the instrument not with the the main electricity electricity is okay but uh, moreover the expression cannot uh, contain the ex- totality of the electricity some portion it it uh, it consumes and thereby it expresses some some way so anyhow we feel some problem the problem is not with the atma so if we, if the problem may be the the problem in the atma alone is responsible for our all problem the same problem has to be there in everywhere but which it is peculiar to ourselves so the problem is limited within our instrument so the uh, we have to understand the functioning of the instrument it also the instrument can be made uh, function properly so we have to we need not uh, connect always with the atma so atma is uh, is common to everything but if you want if if the if the understanding related to atma is helpful we can use the terminology of atma otherwise we can separate the instrument itself and what is the problem within the instrument so the, if the instrument is okay it will create good noise good sound good uh, good thing along so the problem may be related to the the instrument itself so here our mind is the instrument the mind creates many problem so we have to understand the mind understand the functioning of the mind if we understand the functioning of the mind the problem may be go away Uh, to for understanding the mind we need not connect the atma itself but there's a general rule everything is created by atma even though the uh, something is created by the mind uh, the uh, soul responsibility is belong to the atma because it is the energy the beyond the mind itself but anyhow the problem creator is only the mind so we have to understand the Uh, functioning of the mind itself uh, so everybody is having mind but somebody is go- feel good somebody is not feeling good so what is the difference between the functioning of our mind and the other person's mind yes. so you have to understand then if you have the correct understanding we can regulate the mind we can pro- make use of the mind in a good manner so we can have a good result also so we can understand the mind so that is the problem